week, the National Rifle Association fired the opening shot in a battle of words with doctors with this statement on Twitter. Someone should tell self-important anti-con doctors to stay in their lane. The reaction was fast and furious. Thousands of doctors sharing their own experiences with gun trauma, haunting pictures of ER scenes, and stories of how they broke the news to families that they could not save a loved one from a bullet wound, making their point clear with hashtags like, this is my lane and stay in your lane. Well, tonight, new insight into how the medical profession is changing the role future doctors play in making gun safety a health issue here in Spokane. Now, one professor told us it's about teaching students to talk about safety, which in today's world includes firearms. KXY4's Ariana Lake brings us more from this exclusive interview. Ariana? Yeah, by now you're probably used to your doctor's questions about your tobacco use or your sleep habits, but don't be surprised if those questions now start to turn around about firearms. What we encourage ourselves and other physicians to do is to ask, are there firearms in the home? A conversation about gun safety could be coming to a doctor's office near you. Are they stored safely? And if there are kids in the home, what are all the things that we're doing to prevent those children from getting access? Those are questions students at WSU's Elson S. Floyd College of Medicine are learning how to ask. Dr. Ratha Nandagopal says she wants future doctors to treat gun violence as a public health issue. We are concerned about things that affect the public health of our communities and our families. And so guns are part of that conversation. But not everyone believes doctors should ask about firearms. That's really none of their business. Dave Workman is a former firearms instructor and senior editor of the Second Amendment Foundation's GunMag.org. He insists that firearms instructors, not doctors, know about gun safety. I wouldn't go to a gun range to get a tonsillectomy. Workman sides with the NRA, a group that tweeted clear disapproval with the American College of Physicians calling gun violence a public health issue and recommending a ban on semi-automatic weapons. In the end, both sides agree on the goal. It's really because we want to save the lives of the patients that we care for. But disagree on the best way to achieve it. It's really unfortunate because, you know, we're all supposed to be on the same side saving lives. Doctors and medical students in Spokane are advised to approach gun conversations with their patients respectfully and realize many gun owners already take safety very seriously. Recommendations of the patient may include safe gun storage tips, firearm safety classes, or how to properly dispose of an unwanted gun. Live in studio, Ariana Lake, KXLY4 News.